Hey guys, it's me, Kat, and I'm here to give you a preview of my September Ipsy and a review of my August Ipsy. Yay! Anyways, I am in my room. Sam's already in bed. It's about like nine o'clock at night. I just got home from dinner with my husband. And um, my Ipsy finally came in the mail. I thought I was gonna get it yesterday, but I guess with the hurricanes in other parts of the country, the, the packaging or shipping has been kind of a little bit wonky. And I apologize if I haven't uploaded this week. I was kind of hoping this was going to come sooner, and I was kind of hoping my Pat McGrath was going to come in sooner. So, um, so yeah. <laughs> so I thought I'd have it. So I'm going to film this, upload this, and we'll just go from there. And if you see like a plethora of videos in the next few days is because I pre-filmed and I was like, I was gonna film, like, anyways, you, you'll see videos from me soon. So, here's the bag. This is so cute. Look at this. Um, should I sit in the middle? Just sit in the middle. I was gonna sit here. I sat there because I probably already put some pictures of Sam. Maybe I'll just sit here. Maybe I'll stick one here or right there. Whatever. So, cute Ipsy bag. Um, what is this? The question isn't who is going to let me, it's who is going to stop me. Hashtag FC September 2015. So first thing, oh cute, I got a, a good night Luxie brush. I always like getting one. This is like a shape I've never had before. I don't know what I'm going to use this for. Stippling brush? Maybe I'll use this for concealer. Try that out. Excited about that. This is Glow for a Cause Facial Moisturizing Cream, Vanilla and Aloe. Can you see that? Sorry the the, the lighting. I'm still trying. To, it's a it's a lighting that I had from before. There you go. Um, and I don't use it that much. I try to use the natural lighting as much as I can. It smells good. It's, uh, Is this like face cream? Facial moisturizing cream. We'll try that tonight. Very fragrant. Maybe it will dissipate. Let's let's try that out. I'm feeling really out of sorts because I came home. I was in San Diego today. Came home, um, super tired. It was a long, hard drive. Um, took a nap for a lot, like two hours, and so now I'm like wide awake, but normally my body's like in bed so if I'm weird right now it's because my body's like bitch what are you doing so I got this Trace Deep English Rose mini lip glaze I don't think I'm gonna open this I think I'm just gonna give this away I don't want this because I have so many lip products if you saw my Pat McGrath Labs video on my lip swatches in Divine 9 I'll link it in one of the corners like I have a lot Anyways, I have this Smashbox Primer Photo Finish Primerizer. A little primer. Look at that. Put a lotion underneath my finger. We'll try this. Because I'm um, I don't know how I'm feeling about primer. Let's try it on my hand. See if it smells. It's kind of liquidy. Can you see that? Well it doesn't it's, it's clear. I wonder if it's like a moisturizer one. Because I'm feeling like dehydrated primer and moisturizer in one. Hyaluronic acid and niacinamide. Oh, okay. Well, excited about that. We'll try that. And the next thing I have is a cheek blush by Doucet. And this is, let's say what color? RSVP. It's nicely packaged. It's like this. See that? It's a bit of a sheen, so we will try that. And do I have anything else? Oh, that's it. Okay, so I mix out of the four, five things I got. I'm just, I'm gonna give this away. I'm not gonna try this. I am excited about this brush because I love getting brushes. I'm excited about this primer. 
gives like a sticky base, but it feels hydrated. So we'll see how it works on top of makeup or on underneath makeup. And I'm try I'm excited to try this because um yeah, just I want to try try it. So four out of five is good. Let's preview what I got in last month's video or last month's bag. If you didn't see my last month's video, I'll link it in the card so you can check that out. I did get a mascara from MAC. I didn't review that. I don't believe in high-end mascaras, so I didn't use it. I did use this crown brush. I've been, I was mostly using it like underneath my eyes. And then when I traveled, I didn't want to bring too many brushes, so I used it like all over my face to like set my my foundation with powder. I, I think it's a good brush. It's super soft. It's easy to clean. So no complaints there. This will be continued to be in my rotation. I did have this Caladio Cosmetics. It's a blush. And some may say it was a blush topper because it had this like sheen, very shiny. I didn't like this. I mean, it was okay. I, I did it like I tried to do it just as like by itself, and it was okay. I didn't really, I felt like it looked too highlighty. And then I tried to use it as highlighter, it wasn't with the color, and then just the blush topper. And you know, I don't feel like it was like special enough to be a blush topper, so I'm getting rid of this. So, I don't know, I think, I don't know if I'm gonna donate it. I might try to sell it on my Poshmark. Um, if you're not familiar with Poshmark, I'll leave a link in the description below if you wanna check it out. But I might like try to collect a few things and make it like a bundle of affordable makeup and make it like a, maybe a full look. Because I'm selling a lot of stuff, but I have a couple things that are drugstore they're not selling, so. Anyways, check that out. And then I got this Black Tea London Classic Serum by Tony Moly. I love this. I'm almost out. I was at, um, I was hoping that they would carry this serum at um, Ulta, but they only have Tony Moly um, face masks. So I'm kind of bummed. So I need to find out where I can buy this because I think I, I think I want to keep buying this. And then the last thing I have was this answer from. It's Luminous Collagen Eye Cream, and um, I've been using it. I don't notice a difference, but I, I actually stopped using it for a minute because I got a an eye serum from Influencer. If you didn't see that video, I'll link it in the cards. But it's an eye serum from Dr. Who is it? Dr. Some Dr. Paracone. Yeah, Paracone. No, Paracone MD. That's what it is. And um, I wanted to see what it's like, but I don't know. I didn't feel like the serum by itself was hydrating, so I went back to using this, and um, I like it. I like. Um, I don't know if it's going to be life changing for me, so I don't, I'm on the fence if I'm going to repurchase. And I still have a lot, so we'll know, we don't know. So, anyways, that's my unboxing for September, my review for um, August. I have one more month of Ipsy. Because my year, because I paid for a year, it's almost up. So then I need to decide if I'm going to keep it. Um, I heard Ipsy is going to come out with like an Ipsy, Ipsy Plus. I might check that out. Let me know your thoughts if you heard anything more about that. Leave it in the comments. I'd love to hear you guys. And uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And until next time, I love you guys so much. And take care.